Well, this week's show is all about vehicle cyber hacking. And with such a serious threat, it is no wonder there are so many brilliant minds and startups working on providing maximum security to us drivers as we take to the road. And while there's no such thing as a silver bullet to prevent cyber hacking, our next guest, Argus Cybersecurity, provides an holistic approach. And here to tell us more about it is Nicole Marrero, Marketing Director at Argus. Welcome. Hi, how are you? Good. So, let's jump right into the interview. What does Argus do exactly, and how do you protect us from cyber hacking? Uh, so today we have tens of millions of connected cars already on the road and in two years time we'll have hundreds of millions of connected cars. So it means that all this connectivity, even though it's a good thing for drivers, it can also be dangerous because it gives hackers the ability to hack into the car and control it remotely. Uh, different function from little pranks like uh, uh, wipers and sprinklers and up to brakes and steering wheel and uh, basically controlling the whole vehicle while it's moving on the road. So Argus is here to solve this. Uh, we work with the largest automakers and tier ones uh, to protect vehicles from cyber attacks. Uh, we're going into production this year. So Argus Solutions will be on, already on the road this year and we have uh, multiple patents, uh, more than 50 patents uh, granted and pending in order to provide the best security we can to vehicles on the road. So can you tell us or give us some examples of these patents, what specifically you have that protects us? Uh, so it will be too technical to explain the specific patents, but our philosophy is to prevent, understand and respond to cyber attacks. Mm. So basically the first layer is to make it as hard as possible for hackers to penetrate a vehicle. Mm -hmm. Then we give the OEM the ability to understand exactly what happened when an, an attack occurred. And lastly, we give them the ability to respond in a few hours and immunize the fleet of cars so it won't happen again. Now we've already heard a little bit about the threat of, of vehicle hacking, but I'd like to hear from you in your own experience, if you can maybe tell us how real you believe this threat to be. So I think it's an evolution exactly like IT. Mm -hmm. uh, I think that the hacker, hackers are the same hackers as it is for computers. And basically once the car is connected to the internet, it is a computer on wheels. Mm -hmm. So it means that at the moment that the motivation is strong enough, hackers will try to affect the vehicle. Now, if we look at things like ransomware, for example, in which hackers can find uh, a financial motivation, so I think that in a few years time, we will see it happening more and more. And when you say financial motivation, can you explain that to our viewers? Sure, so for example, today we see uh, major attacks on organizations in which they are required to pay money in order to release their data right. from being encrypted. So the same way exactly, you can go into your vehicle one day and the screen of the multimedia will say you need to pay us a certain amount of money in order to drive again. Now if we're thinking for example on a fleet of trucks uh, that should deliver uh, things to a certain address and once you stop this fleet of trucks, it costs the company a lot of money, they will definitely prefer to pay it and release their business from being captive. And can you tell us a little bit about the history of the company, where the idea came from to provide sort of an holistic approach to cybersecurity? So Argus was founded by three ex-officers of the 8200 unit. Um, they met in the army and after working for a few years in the industry, they came together mm -hmm. and they looked for something that first w will make a big impact, a positive impact in the world. Secondly, that it will be a need in the market. And thirdly, that their cybersecurity expertise will be significant in this, uh, in this matter. So they found this, they identified the need. Uh, and when they started, uh, not everyone agreed with them. But today we can see that it's a major problem uh, multiple OEMs and companies were already affected by this and we can see that it's growing, legislation is already also going there and uh, this is exactly what they looked for. And so today you're working with all the major car manufacturers around the world? Exactly, we work with car manufacturers and tier ones uh, which supply uh, for the car manufacturers and we're working together with them. We, already, we, we also 
um, give them services such as uh, penetration testing and risk assessment to identify what are the most critical risks and how they should address them. And I understand that it's not just on the road, but that Argus also works at keeping us safe up in the air. So uh, this is a new vertical that we started addressing, but our main focus was the automotive and we're the global leader uh, in the automotive cybersecurity industry and this is a very big thing for us. I'm proud to say that an Israeli startup made it to be the global leader in this field. Absolutely, that's an incredible accomplishment. Well, Nicole, thank you so much for taking the time to speak with us today. Thank you.